Hey guys, just wanted to do a quick video to help you get onto MyOpenMath for the first time. Uh, so first thing you want to go is just to MyOpenMath.com and then we need to log in for the first time. So I'm going to pretend that I'm a student, so I'm going to register as a new student. Go ahead and click on that. And then it's going to want you to put in a username and some information. So I'm just going to use some dummy information. We will put in, I don't know, E. Harris, we'll choose a password. Uh, looks like that one's already taken already. We'll do E. Harris 11. Okay, I'll put in my first name, last name, and then the email address. I'll just do some dummy one as well. Uh, turn off notifications. If you want to notif your notifications, you can have them there and then okay so here we've got my teacher gave me a course ID so if you go back to Moodle now depending if you're the online class or if you're my in-person class the the values are going to be a little different this is going to be example for my online class uh, so go to Moodle you're going to copy the course ID go back to my open math we're going to paste it and then you also want to go back to Moodle copy your enrollment key paste it or you can type it in either is okay and we're just going to click sign up uh, agree to the terms of use if you want to read them you can click on there and read them it's pretty standard open source not a lot of warranty on this uh, but anyhow if you care go ahead and read it if not just join on in go ahead and sign up and then it says that, oh, it appears in the account already exists with the same email. Oh, okay. So that's how we would do it. I'm going to create this new account anyways. Okay, now I'm going to return to the login page. And now we can go here. We're going to go e Harris 11 That was my username. Type in my password. I'm going to click login. And then this is going to be the courses that you're taking. Okay, so we are going to click on this online class that I had you sign up for and lo and behold there it is it's got your first section already got the calendar up and rolling and then as I complete the other sections I'll show them and as we go along in class you'll see more and more but hopefully that gets you started on how to get into my open math